It is interesting to think that I haven't moved for decades from this spot yet. I'm not bored and I can't imagine living anywhere else. When I arrived in Eats family and when the new extension of their home at the Kettle's Yard house was completed, I was placed at one of the most prominent spots. Every visitor has to walk past me. I get to see a lot of people and hear a lot of stories too. My name is 1924, Versa number two. I am a painting and I was born in 1924. My father, Ben Nicholson, inscribed my name on my back. This means that I am a portrait of an existing person, not just some imaginary woman. Not everybody knows my name because Kettlesyard is not like a gallery. There are no labels or do not touch signs. There are of course many visitors who come prepared and discuss my appearance and history. Many times I have heard that my dad was really interested in Renaissance fresco paintings and that I have been created in this slightly worn, brushed fresco style. Also that my head and my shoulders are bigger than life size means I would be giant in real life. People are often talking about my striking eyes gazing past them. But the best is when they try to imagine who was the real Bertha. You see, nobody knows, and so the visitors come up with lots of plots and funny stories. Apparently, Bertha was Ben's secret lover because she's painted nude. Or Bertha is a self-portrait because Ben wasn't sure about his gender. Sometimes it is amusing, but also that's what makes me interesting. I'm the portrait of a mysterious woman. All we know for sure is that I was painted in 1924 by Ben Nicholson and that I am an oil and graphite painting, 61 centimeters tall and 56 centimeters wide. Come and see me. I want to know who do you think Bertha was.